Hi guys, this is how to play the Rockefeller Skank by Fatboy Slim. Something totally different today on, on this kind of channel. We'll need a capo of third fret to be able to play the bulk of the song, which is just three chords throughout. We have an E major chord, a G, and an A. So if you can play those three chords, you can do this song. And Fatboy Slim compiled different elements of different older songs um, to make this song, the Rockefeller Skank. Um, so the chords to it are the Just Brothers and Sliced Tomatoes. Um, that's the chords part. And then the little bit of demo we did in the start is the is sampled from the art of noise by peter gunn and i will leave those links in the description down below so that you can hear the original versions and how they're like similar to the song and and what he added and and how he compiled them to basically make this song so we will need a capo to be able to do this song but other than that it's it's a really it's kind of basic so great for beginners to get used to lots of easy rock riffs and if you want more of them there's of course this easy rock riffs playlist uh, but let's get you straight in, into a close-up to teach you how to play uh, Fat Boy Slim Rockefeller Skank. So I think the most signature thing about this song is the little surf guitar riff which goes like this. Um, so we're doing this by putting our first finger at third fret of the thickest E string and then we're going to bend that note down quite far you can see when I bend it it's physically going quite far down um, and then straight after that well a little time after that we play the open A string so string six bend it down and there's a couple of things you want to watch first of all we're letting the bend ring out longer than we are the A string so as soon as you pick the bend let it ring out as soon as you pick string five, straight back to doing the bend. And the other thing is with the bend itself, you don't want to let the bend sound like it's coming back up at all. So you bend down, you don't come back up. That's what it sounds like when you're not used to it. You need to make sure your bend just goes down and as you're wanting to bring it back up, you don't let it go back up, you let go of it, pick the open A string. And uh, as a note, Fatboy Slim changed um, the audio of this song to make it sound like it's two frets down. So he took it down by a tone um, in whatever audio production software or, or hardware he was using. So, that isn't going to be quite in tune with the record. The rest of this lesson will be, but that first bit, I just think that's a really uh, cool lick to get under your belt. And in the, that's me just picking the A string twice to show you a variation of it. And you can just um, pick it once as well, which is what happens in the Rockefeller Skank. So that's something to have a bit of fun with, but as I say, hard to play that one onto the record without tuning your guitar down. Um, for the rest of the song, we're going to need a capo on third fret, or a capo third fret. And that's when we start to get the sound of the record for... The Sliced Tomatoes by the Just Brothers. So we just need three chords. We need a standard E major proportionate to that capo. Guitar nice and clean. Electric guitar going through the clean channel of your amp. And this will sound just fine. Then we go for a standard way of playing a G major. 
Third or fourth finger down, or just the third finger down, doesn't matter, it's fun. And then we need a way of playing an A major chord, you can go for three in a line, you can put your first finger in the middle, however you play an A major chord, I'm playing it like this, that'll be totally fine. So we have a whole bar of the E, one, two, three, four, G for two, A for two, one, two, three, four. Check it out now, the funk soul brother, right about now, the funk soul brother. Check it out now, the funk soul brother, right about now, the funk soul brother. Strumming there, down, down, up, up, down, 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 up, down. Down, down, up, up, down on the E. Down, 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 up, down. There's a little skip on the A. Down, down, up, up, down, down, down. And that's the whole chords part of the song. The only other bit that happens in the song that I'd recommend we have a look at. Is the little lead line from the song. And that is picking the open E string. Where we do the down, down, up, up, down. And then we pick uh, the first finger at second fret proportionate to the capo on the fifth string and we do down down up up down down up up and then the next down is on the first fret of the E string so down down up up down on the thickest D down down up up on the uh, string five and then back to string six for that last down really James Bond. Which is a lesson coming your way real soon or I might have even uploaded it by now. I can't even remember I'm uploading that many lessons at the moment. But... Down, down, up, up, down. Down, down, up, up, down, down. That is how to play the Rockefeller Skank. So that's how to play the Rockefeller Skank by Fatboy Slim on guitar. Uh, I hope you enjoyed that. I know it's something a little bit different for you guys. But as ever, thank you very much for watching. And of course, you can subscribe by clicking the link down below or across in the top corner to get all the newest updates from this channel, all the newest lessons.